Champlain Charter School handed out COVID-19 tests to both students and families in an effort to keep the school COVID-free before the bell rings again on Thursday. Here is Marcus Espinoza. West Oak Lane Charter School doing what it can to get students back in the classroom, offering free COVID-19 testing to not only students, but their families as well. We are trying to prepare to bring all of our students back into the building. So we thought it would be a great idea to test them and all of their family members. And our plan is to bring everyone back in the building next Thursday. Dr. Debera Peoples-Lee is the CEO here at West Oak Charter Lane. Right now, her students are on a hybrid schedule, but she wants that to change to fully in-person learning. We tested all of our staff on Monday, so all of our staff are clear. We were so pleased to know that they're free of COVID. El Aquala is a student here. She brought her parents along to get tested for COVID-19 as well. She's ready to get back to school full time. Because I don't have to be at home on the computer. It's just kind of boring. Yeah. I miss my friends. It's hard to focus. Yeah. Her mom told us she's grateful the charter school is offering quick PCR testing inside, especially when it's been very difficult for most people to find adequate testing sites. I think it's great because I know a lot of people have been having a hard time finding the test. So to be able to drive up like we live five minutes away mm -hmm. to go like up the street to my daughter's school and be able to be in and out, I think is very helpful. Miss Howard is a teacher here, and she says she understands why the kids want to be back. She said teachers are right there with them. Just think having a little taste of their kids half the time um, definitely makes us eager to have all of our kids back. It's definitely a different teaching experience being in the building than being home uh, virtual. The threshold, according to the Philadelphia Health Department, in order to return to in-person learning is less than 3% of students can be positive with COVID-19. They hope to go back on January 20th after getting these test results. In Northwest Philadelphia, Marcus Espinoza, Fox 29 News.